Okay, welcome, welcome, welcome. This is going to be for Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Staying alive, staying alive. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right, this is going to be for week two. For June, holy hot up in here. Up in here, up in here. All right, let's see what we're looking at. I feel like there's a breakaway. There's a breakaway. There's a breakaway. All right. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Week two. Sleeper Gemini close week too. Mm, okay, so like right now, someone's just kind of, it's, it's like control in a way. It's the four of swords, right? It's supposed to be rest and healing, but this is like, I never read this card as control. It's like mental control with the eight of swords here. Um... Queen of Swords is watching. We had something like that in water earlier, and it was the Queen of Swords watching something go down. Maybe someone's making a break, you know, there's new love in town, or you just want to get back out there and it's self-love, you know, because this is not that. So it's, it's some type of mental control. I don't, you know, I can't tell if you're keeping yourself bound or, you know, there is some type of interference. We have the magician. So somebody's really considering how to make this next move when it comes to this love because it's it's lonely without somebody. Um, but there's somebody. That's that's just it. I don't know where that somebody is. Somebody to love. Wow, that came out at the same time. Justice in the Knight of Cups. I don't know if you're dealing with a Libra. It's just, it's, it's time to balance the scales. I would normally want to be like, that's karma, but in this predicament, it's wanting to be back in each other's arms. Like, it's, it'd be mutual. Because there's something mutual here, and it's, it's growing as the Ace of Cups. It's two people. And then there's somebody else here. So if you've been feeling left out in the cold, that type of stuff, like that's that's coming to an end with justice being here. Someone's gonna come in and tell you how they feel. Cause someone's manifesting you right now or vice versa. Yeah, the love is making a decision. So there definitely was too many people in the picture. <clears throat> Something was delayed, it's, it's about to be It's about to move forward. Um, this is purposely blocking someone mentally. But higher power is going to take care of it. Someone's, you know, has a choice to make. Looks like they're going to make the choice. It's it's here. Oh, well, I can't say that. Opportunities here. I can say that. But I instantly felt a break, a breakaway. This is almost like someone can't stop thinking about somebody else. Someone's not focused on this person anymore, which is this person watching. So she's right here. He's focused on something else. But obviously there's still something. It doesn't mean everybody's sleeping together. It just means somebody came in and showed somebody how something's supposed to feel. So if there's been like a break or something like that, like I said, it's because someone's manifesting. They're trying to come up with something. It's, it's, well, it's the Ten of Swords reversed, right? So it's like somebody's not accepting. 
And then you got the nine of cups. So that's right off the rip. Someone's whoever this person is too. Is also witnessing someone way happier elsewhere. So it looks like, you know, the third party is getting taken down. But it's, it's going to linger. Someone's going to linger for a little while because they don't want to accept it. Um, this is the three of swords. Initially, I thought it was the eight. And it really is the same woman. It's whoever's watching here. And somebody else is so focused on somebody else. Like, it is, it's crazy. You should really go watch Water. It was a lot like that. So I don't think there's too much to worry about. Like, someone might not have took an offer, so you're feeling lonely. Or someone rejected. Or this is right around the corner. Let's talk about this Ace of, Ace of Cups. I want to say coin, so that's strange. So it only come out like three times. Two of Swords, so making a decision. At first, not wanting to, not wanting to see it. This is more leaning towards someone not wanting to see something go down for some reason. But it's it's like it's here. It's, it's already manifested. Tell me about this Queen of Swords. So whether it's you guys or, or somebody else, it's, it's just whoever was like um, intruding, like a decision being made. The devil reverse. So yeah, it's like coming out of something that was toxic with the Three of Cups here. Okay, so too many people in the picture. But this is not one. The, the devil reverse, too, is not acknowledging that something's unhealthy. It is, you know, slowly and surely coming out of it. But so this person, you know, is, is hurt that somebody else is in the picture. And then you got the king of swords reversed over here. So you might be dealing with a masculine that's not even talking about this scenario. I feel like this is being kept from you. I don't really see anything being kept. Somebody here doesn't know the whole story. That's why there was delays and somebody wasn't accepting. But somebody was still manifesting and bringing something into fruition as everything was going down. Um, so it's like he's not even wanting to talk about it. He could be hurting, but I think it's more like and that's the king of swords and that's the queen of swords it could have been a married couple here that could have, you know court couples but he doesn't want to talk about it either he's like detaching but that can be an angry card sometimes too and i was just asking and it's it's the eight of swords and that's originally what i thought it was right there so again it's like their focus is elsewhere. It really is. See the nine of pence, which I, is the energy of just independence, unless he or she is looking at somebody like that, because that's how it was with the energy. There's a woman here um, with the weekly energy. Tell me about this eight of swords, because I don't think it's I don't think it's that blockage anymore. Like there's a blockage that's been removed. Like somebody just has to suck it up now. Ten of pens, the star. So more focused on this person's more focused on money than anything else right now. And the magician here, we got the page of wands. So it's a messenger coming in. There's that ace of pens that I felt. But that's the Ace of Cups. I wanted to say Pence again. So somebody is trying to talk about, well, this could be messages going back and forth regarding money. The Seven of Cups, yeah. Like strategies, options, what do we do next? You got the star, hoping something's going to work out. So it's it's positive. So you, there really is somebody here that, like, there's just something's really been kept from you. 
and it looks like it's going to come to light in the Emperor reverse. Is somebody angry that's not doing nothing with the Five of Pence, feeling lonely? We got the lovers right here. So we got the lover, lovers twice with the Queen of Swords. So yeah, ain't like the Hermit, um, King of Pence reverse. So there, this reading really is more based around this one energy that does not want to accept something, didn't want to see something, but it is, it's like slipping away from her it's like out of her control like yeah they miss and they're trying to like coerce they're up to something but he's putting zero effort into what this is it's almost like he's not falling for it, it, it but it could be tricky i don't think he's feeding into it but the lovers the queen of swords and the hermit but she definitely, you know, is, is like I said, it was kind of blocking this love, but not no more. The Emperor Upright would be doing like nothing and controlling and, you know, so this is, it's, it's really actually, the Emperor is never really that positive a card to see reverse, but that right there with him not doing anything is, okay, so the Knight of Swords reversed once again. See, like not talking about it, not happy, not communicating, not going back and forth because it's not good. Focused on the Nine of Cups, Two of Pens reverse. It's you know dropping something to you know balance the scales elsewhere. So this is you're gonna get a message from a lover depending on who you are. If you were the other person here, the, the messages are coming in. Someone wants to tell you how they feel. Like they've been manifesting, planning, they've been doing stuff. Like they're just breaking free. They're you're dealing with somebody who's more focused on money and longevity and long term and something solid, which is great. Got a practical energy here. Um, you do have this woman over here that's just kind of not accepting now. But whoever this is, it's like here comes balance. Here comes justice. Here, you know. Universal law, someone's going to come at you, you're going to get a message, you know, regarding feelings, um, you know, wanting to talk. I don't know if it's like, hey, I made a decision, I don't know what you guys are going to be discussing. I think just something that you didn't know was going down. Yeah, the tower, bam. It could be her tower, too. Because he's gonna, she's gonna realize he's going in this direction. He's choosing someone else. The nine of wands. They're not giving up. They're going. So it, it is sudden. It is out of the blue. Okay, eight of cups reversed. So this, the tower is like somebody. It's almost like someone tried to walk away but couldn't walk away and wants to come back around. Water was like that too with the world. See, so it's like an ending and a new beginning. It's not going, it's not going backwards. This is somebody who was thinking about it. So this one doesn't want to release all this, right? So this one's going to, this one's getting the tower. The feminine here is getting the tower. Tell me about the lovers. And somebody else is going right towards the lovers. King of Pence one has come out. Tell me about the lovers. Okay. What you say? The Fool. It's a brand new stat. It's a brand new stat. Okay. So I will continue this on Patreon. But more of the story is if, if something wasn't moving, it's going to stop moving. There's going to be more communication. Um, there is one energy here. Like I said, it's, it's not really going her direction. She's not too happy about the situation. She's not really wanting to accept and she's just going to try to find to, she's, she's going to attempt to make her way back in by using emotions or, um, sexting it, it whatever it is, it's, it's not going to work. Okay. There's a brand new start with a lover and it's, it's not all this. This was somebody who was with somebody where it was just, it was painful. It was unhealthy. Looks like it was possibly toxic. There was lots of blockages. You know, it, it's just things will sort stuff. Things will sort itself out in due time. You know, and it, there's it, there's still a little bit of a delay because you have an energy here that's still interfering. It doesn't. She 
he or she is not going to be successful at it, right? But it, it, that's what the Four of Swords and then the Ten of Swords reverse is like not accepting. How do I get back with the Eight of Cups reversed after this tower? You know, because they already see it's slipping. It's been slipping. You know? So. And others of you, you're going to have to decide whether you want somebody new or not. Some of you, this is like you have, some of you, you just started dating somebody and you're like, I don't know what to do. I think you're going to keep your options open. Because you're deciding, do I even want this? But this could also be the other person that's not even coming up, whoever this other lover is that this new side is with. That could be her having to make a, a decision. Others, you have to rest in a shitty scenario, like something's coming in and you might want to open up a little bit to new things. Karma's kicking in for those who are, you know, not learning and, and there's new starts here. It's just the start of something. It's small, but it's the start. It really stinks that you're still trying to go after something that doesn't even, you know, it's not really focused on you right now. Or it's just, it's a tough dynamic. But you have to accept that it's, it's over here. And if this is linked to her, the Three of Swords, she could be playing, calling, you know, crying wolf, you know, and uh, it's really all about the money purposely keeping you in a situation for security reasons, because the Ten of Pence is, is security, comfort, you know, yeah, see, separation, camera reminiscing, looking back at the past, which is what she's trying to do, come back around. Missing you, unsure about the future, not really knowing what to do with themselves. Um, so, like I said, it's, it's not harsh. Comic relationship came out, you know. Turmoil lessons, letting go, loving you. So, yeah, you know, it's it's figuring out that it needs, you know, you need to let go. So, like I said, there's there's a breakthrough, you know. So, no matter who you are, hang in there. Well, I mean, if you're the comic, hang in there. If you're the other one that's like feel like you missed an opportunity or it's just slow or delays like the delays are, are they're wrapping up like yeah about it, whether they wrap it up and you know you work on it together or you had enough and you're like you know what I'm done with this yada yada and you know you you are gonna meet somebody new it, it's here the, it's the past it's the comic and it's brand new it just depends what category you're in and if in the last four months you went through a shit show, you went through something like this, you got brand new love coming at you. Just don't go in blindly because you might be being tested. Okay. All right, I love you guys. Let me just do this real quick. Because I feel in the way, tell me about the magician. Because some of you, um... That's why I was like, be careful you don't go into something blindsided. Because I just want to make sure it's not like wicked tricky. Because it's the page of something. You got this feeling you just can't shake it. Listen to that shit. So, it, no, it's more intuition. It's, it's you going after something you want. So that's positive. Just wanted to make sure whatever. Yeah, see, it's like, fuck fear. So it, it's not awful. It's... Could be just fearing like getting into this again after getting out of a karmic or falling in love again after being hurt. It, it really just depends on your scenario. But I just wanted to make sure somebody wasn't going in something into something blindfolded. Because with the two of swords, sometimes you know you're blindfolded and you're just kind of like, oh, you're just kind of riding the wave. But like you don't always want to ride that wave. So hold on. <laughs> Ooh, I almost see not today, not enough. So it's this chick that was blindfolded, didn't want to see it. 
So I don't know if she offered again or she just realizes somebody else is falling in love. Like I said, it's, it really is boiling down to this one person that's just like, didn't want to see something or see you, you know? And others of you, is something is coming together with the new lover. It's the fool. It's a brand new journey. It's the start of something new. Don't let fear get the best of you. And it's, like I said, you, you can't shake it. There's just something here that just, when you have a connection like that, it's, it's a very hard thing to shake, you know? So, um, let me just find out about the, the lovers right here. With the fool, because I want to see if you, you're just like, fuck this and you're going on your merry way. Now, interested, talking, conversating more, texting, emails, hovering. So you're either still talking to this person is the whole dating thing because you did go your merry way. So, abundance, wedding rings, keep a positive mindset, manifest what you want. So don't let fear get in the way. All right. So it's like you're feeling something or you're going to feel something. Union, married, soul connection. All right, so that that's a given with the lovers. That could even be a past life that you're feeling, but it's with a fool. It's, it's brand new. It's going to make you happy. I love you guys. Bye.